Blog Talk Radio. You're listening to The Limo Show, presented by Town Livery. And here's your host, David Bastion. Good evening, everyone, and welcome to The Limo Show. We're coming to you 24 hours a day, seven days a week via the World Wide Web. My name is David Bastian, your host, bringing you the limo show on Blog Talk Radio. I encourage anyone out there that's listening to the live stream to call the limo show hotline in the second half of the show. If you have any questions for myself or any of our guests tonight, you can reach us at the limo show hotline at 714-868-0786. That's 714 868 Zero seven eight six. On this program, The Limo Show, we frequently discuss the benefits of attending local and national limousine trade shows, as well as the value of participating in your local or national limousine associations. Both of these items, I feel, are the key ingredient to helping build a strong foundation for your company. Tonight's show is a show I've been looking forward to all day. It's a show that's going to focus on the upcoming 2011 Limousine Digest Show, uh, that's going to be held in Atlantic City, New Jersey. The show is going to run from November 6th through November 9th at the Trump Taj Mahal Casino and Resort. We have a bunch of special guests tonight uh, that will be coming on to give you a sneak peek preview of the events and seminars that will be available at, the, at this year's show. We also have some of the vendors that you will be seeing at the show, and uh, they're going to check in tonight with our program, and they're going to, get, they're going to tell us where they're located and Tell us about some special deals that they have available at the show. Now, to help kick off this exciting show, I'd like to welcome the publisher of Limousine Digest, Chris Weiss. Chris, welcome to the Limo Show. Thanks, Dave. Uh, Pleasure to be here. Thank you for coming on. Uh, We talked off the air, and you mentioned that uh, lately your head's been spinning because uh, you've been doing a lot of planning for the show. Can you give us the listeners a preview of what to expect for this year's show? Yeah, you know, as always, it's four jam-packed days, um, educational opportunities and seminars, networking events and functions, um, you know, a, a bustling trade show floor with side-by-side buying power. We've got a, an affiliate speed meet and some some great nightlife activities, some some theme parties. Uh, We have a tailgaters theme party. We have a Bourbon Street party. And, of course, we always um, have an award scale in conjunction with a -A Make-A-Wish charity auction. I look forward to the uh, tailgate party. That's a lot of fun because everybody shows up wearing their team colors and you you get to kind of jab uh, your friends that root for the the opposing teams that that your local teams rival. I think that's a great uh, time. And uh, the speed meet program, I think, is is excellent. Can you tell us about the Speed Meet program and uh, how it works? Yeah, it, it's set up like speed dating, but it's a, a show for transportation companies meeting them, one another that way. And all tables are set up uh, around the perimeter of a room, and people go from table to table and have two-minute sessions to speed meet other transportation companies across the country. And we have upwards of 35 exhibitors and there will probably be 150 or so uh, people walking the event, uh, meeting these exhibitors. Uh, they're, they're time sessions, and it, it's a really intense and, and robust experience. It, it almost feels like giving birth. You meet so many people in, a, in such a short period of time. No doubt about it. This year's keynote speaker will be Jeff Hargett, and he's from the Ritz-Carlton Leadership Center. I was reading online that the Ritz-Carlton Leadership Center is the number one training organization uh, recognized by Training Magazine. Uh, What will be this year's topic, and can you tell us a little bit about the speaker? Yeah, the topic is igniting your employees' passion for service excellence. And, you know, realistically, who better than the Ritz-Carlton to teach anyone about customer service excellence? And it's you know, it's set up so that it, there's going to be, you know, a lot of uh, take-home value to it. And, you know, your, your staff is always your front line and being able to motivate your staff 
to provide the type of customer service that you know that, that you you know have um, you know in mind is, is you know is always a, a great thing. And you know it's the session is set up to you know for companies who want to involve their employees in the planning of of all of the work that affects them. And, you know participants will learn the critical importance of of a strategic plan for every employee in the organization. And it, it really focuses on, you know, just providing the high level of service that, that our, you know, our industry needs to be in tune with. Over the last few years, uh, I've participated with our association in what you call the Association Alley. Uh, I think that, that that's, a, a gra- that's a great concept that Limousine Digest came up with. Uh, I think it allows for a lot of networking. Where will Association Alley be located this year? It, it's located in the back of the exhibit hall, and it, it's it's uh, approximately 18 or so associations participating from all over the country. And you know, I agree with you. It's a, a great opportunity for not only the associations to, you know, build membership and, and cultivate new members, but to interact with each other in a, in a casual setting that they're able to, you know, build relationships and bonds and learn about what other associations are going through and, and you know, what might be coming down the pike. On Sunday, you're going to have an association summit, and this is going to lead to our, our next special guest tonight. Uh, we're going to, I would like to welcome to the show Doug Schwartz from the Long Island Limousine Association, and uh, Doug's going to be speaking. Doug, are you there? Dave? Yeah, Dave, I'm on the line. Yeah! Okay, welcome to the show. Uh, now, you're going to be leading the seminar uh, or association summit. Uh, can you tell us about the summit and uh, what we can expect or what the attendees can expect from that summit? Well, this is my first time uh, participating in the in the summit. We do have a fairly nice schedule of things uh, that we're planning. Uh, these are going to be some presidents from associations around the country. We have uh, five topics that we're working on together now. We hope to hone in uh, before we get to the, the seminar and have as much information as we can share. Just to give you a brief overview of the things we're going to try and share there is uh, some of our best practices for creating membership and revenue for the association. We're going to talk about some uh, DOT situations that are happening in different parts of the country. Uh, also, uh, different things that are happening at airports that you know certainly involve a lot of limousine companies. Uh, the labor and overtime issue in the federal government and the Ride Act, still working on that. And uh, it should be interesting. It takes place on Sunday. I think it's 3.30, 3.30. It should be uh, very interesting. I understand there's always a good participation and attendance, you know, at the event. And I'm hoping that it's going to be a completely open forum of uh, questions and answers. And I can tell you that uh, I don't know which Limo Digest show number this is for me, but, you know, certainly since I've been involved in the industry, I've, I've made every one, you know, since I really know what they're about. And, and I just want to, you know, explain to the listeners or, or really, you know, uh, let them know how I feel that, you know, the knowledge is really the power in this industry. And if you have the knowledge and you can really get the information, you can really do well in your business. And these events, I, I find uh, other operators to be so warm and sharing of information. It's just, it's just packed full of information. And I always come back from uh, the digest so charged and try and take things away and bring them back to my business and, and put them in play, and I get a lot of good results. So it's a terrific thing. I agree. And, and when you get a group of people in a room together and, and they're all sharing their, their best practices, like you mentioned, you're definitely going to walk away with, uh, you know, with knowledge uh, that you can apply to your business. This year's awards gala, and you mentioned that, Chris, it's going to benefit the Make-A-Wish Foundation, and, and I, I know that, Limousine Digest has had a long-standing relationship with Make-A-Wish Foundation. I, I do have to say that I have never seen an organization uh, devote so much energy, uh, you know, to a charity like like you guys have done. You've done a tremendous job, and you know it should be commended. Now, well, thank you. this year, you're welcome. You guys have done a great job. Now, how many years have you been associated with? Make a wish, and uh, what is this year's goal that you're looking to achieve as far as dollars raised? This is our ninth year with Make a Wish, and to date we've raised uh, just under eight hundred thousand. 
And our goal is... I have to give you that. that that's, that's a big number, huge number. Th- thanks, thanks. And... Uh, our, our goal, and we're very fortunate. We, we um, you know, we're an industry of people that know people, and you know, I, I call on many friends in this business to donate items, and you know, the list of, and I've actually was just working on it prior to, you know, calling in, and the list of items that we have for this year is, it's, it's absolutely off the charts, and you know, ideally, in a perfect world, we're able to raise along the lines of of what we've raised in the past, which is upwards of a hundred thousand dollars per year. And, you know, I, I see no reason why we wouldn't be able to do that based on the items that we have. We also, when any item doesn't actually sell at the auction, we um, create an eBay auction through Make-A-Wish after the show. And we were actually instrumental in um, setting a tone for Make-A-Wish nationally. We were their guinea pig. Last year we were their, their first auction to use eBay for a post-event. And... They now use eBay for all of their auctions that when they don't, you know, get an item sold for the amount that they were hoping to sell it for. So it, it was. Wow, um, that's awesome. Yeah. So beyond the fact that we, that we, you know, were able to help out this great cause, you know, we actually gave them some direction that they now use nationally, and it's, uh, you know, it's really rewarding. And so, you know, ideally we hit the hundred thousand mark this year, and. You know, our goal initially was to raise a million dollars for Make-A-Wish, and we're not really all that far off. I know, just a few more years, and and this year, let's set that goal to hit well over a hundred. Uh, let's, I mean, it'd be great if that happened. Yeah, we have en- we have enough items and donations that we certainly could do so. So if everyone is generous enough and you know and, and opens up their hearts and their wallets, then we should be in wonderful shape. That's awesome. At the awards gala, uh, and this is something I, I spoke about, or spoke about, or spoke with Dan Goff last week about uh, when we did our show in our last uh, edition of Limo Show. Uh, the Limousine Digest is going to be honoring the first recipient of a new war, award, named in the honor of the late Dean Schuler. Uh, the award is called the Friend of the Industry Award. Chris, can you share with us some of your thoughts on Dean, and uh, first of all, the impact he made on the industry? Well, beyond the impact he made on the industry, you know, the impact that he made on Limo Digest and me personally is, um, you know, unable to really put it into words. Um, You know, Dean had been with the magazine and and been a friend of mine since the first issue that we published. I have never met a person that was more supportive, dedicated, and loyal and, and such a good friend and selfless and you know, I still I still can't believe that he's gone, and we're we're coming up on on the year anniversary of his passing, and we just felt it was a necessity to create an award to honor his name and and to keep his name alive, and it, you know it, the award is really given out to someone who you know selflessly gives their time to help others in the business, you know without any type of compensation monetarily or in any way. So it's really, um, you know, an award for selfless acts. Definitely. And the person that, that wins is going to have some big shoes to fill. Do you agree? I, I don't think anyone can fill Dean's shoes. But, um, you know, cer- certainly it's uh, it'll be an honor for whoever it is that, that walks away with the award. We have, you know, three great finalists. Um, Ron Stein from Exclusive Sedan. Carl Laborde from Associated. And also Joe Jordan, who is from Jordan Limousines. And all, wow, that's all great. worthy of the award. That's great. Yeah, I, uh, I've i mentioned on the show before, uh, Dean was a, was also a friend to me. Uh, there, there were many a times when I had done something with, with our marketing or an email blast or, or whether it was something our advertising, and Dean would see it. And if he thought it was interesting, he'd call me up and say, Dave, wow, that was great. You did a great job, and, and I really appreciated his feedback. You know, So I, I definitely will miss him, too. Uh, so I think it's great that you guys are, are doing uh, an, uh, giving an award in his honor. Uh, Chris and Doug, I'm going to have another special guest on. He's going to be one of the speakers at your seminars. Bear, Mr. Gross, are you there? Yeah. Yeah, hi, Dave. Uh, I'm on. Great. Welcome to the limo show. 
So you're going to be well, doing a you. seminar at uh, this year's show, and it's going to pertain to mystery shopping. Can you tell the listeners a little bit about what to expect at your seminar? Yeah, I'd be delighted. And uh, before I do, uh, I certainly want to say hi to uh, uh, Chris and Doug, two of my close friends in, in the business, and uh, uh, remark how uh, excited uh, I am to see them again up at the show. It's just a terrific event every year. Uh, I am back. honored. <laughs> Thanks. I'm honored to uh, participate uh, for the first time as a speaker, and uh, I'll be sharing the stage with Brett Tyson from Harrison Global. And we're going to present uh, a seminar called Mystery Shopping, How Great Companies Design and Manage an Effective Program. And uh, the more we got into this, the more it became apparent that many companies do a terrific job of uh, training their people, setting the guidelines and parameters for terrific service and really are concerned with delivering the product, but they don't have any credible way of, of measuring that. And what we have set out to do is to define mystery shopping, uh, to uh, uh, lay out parameters as to why mystery shopping is important and how you can use that to actually uh, generate measurables so you can, you can determine where and how to target your training. In the automobile industry, I know we definitely use uh, mystery shopping. How long will the seminar be? Well, I, I, I've got it right here. We're on a, a Monday the 6th, uh, and we start at 9 a.m. We've got an hour and a quarter, and, uh, boy, we intend to use every minute of it. Chris, Doug, Mr. Barry Gross, thank you for coming on the show to talk about uh, the upcoming show. I think it's going to be exciting. Chris, do you want to uh, leave us with anything before you go and, and we head off the break? Yeah, I, I do. I, I, the, our website is www.limoshow.com, and there's no place that you're going to be able to get, uh, you know, in, in, in a four-day span, a better education, more networking opportunities, and just an overall great time than in coming to Atlantic City for the Limo Digest show. There's something for everyone, and the, you know the opportunities that that are there are, are really endless. So, and I thank you, Dave. Cool. And I thank you guys for coming on the show. Uh, we greatly appreciate it. We're going to head off to break, and when we come back, we're going to open up the phone lines uh, to some of the vendors that we'll be calling in. Uh, you can reach us at the Limo Show hotline at 714-868-0786. That's 714-868-0786. You're listening to the Limo Show here on Blog Talk Radio. Would you like a marketing partner that not only understands marketing, but knows the transportation industry inside and out? Are you struggling to attract new customers, retain your current customers, or win back lost customers? If you find yourself saying yes to any of these questions, there's only one place to call. Call the marketing wizard of the limousine industry, Arthur Messina from Create-A-Card. Create-A-Card is the number one supplier of business cards, marketing supplies, and promo items to the limousine industry of North America. Contact Create-A-Card today at 1-800-753-6867. That's 1-800-753-6867. So they can help transform your marketing and advertising into consistent sales-generating machines. You can also find us on the web at createacardinc.com. That's createacardinc.com. Are you looking to add an Executive L Town Car to your fleet? If you are, call Town Livery. Town Livery is a franchise Ford, Lincoln, Chrysler, and BMW dealer that specializes in selling livery vehicles nationwide. Town Livery is located in Buffalo, New York, is able to ship your vehicle to you at an affordable price. So, when you think of livery vehicles, think of Town Livery. Town Livery can be reached at 800-730-3683. That's 800-730-3683. One-stop shopping at Town Livery. You're listening to The Limo Show. Blog Talk Radio. Welcome back. You are listening to the Limo Show presented by Town Livery. Heard 24 hours a day, seven days a week on Blog Talk Radio. Today's show is all about the upcoming 2011 Limousine Digest show that is a little over a week away. The show is going to run from November 6th through the 9th, 
and it's going to be held at the Trump Taj Mahal Casino in Atlantic City, New Jersey. Now, this is the part of the show, that, like I mentioned before, that is dedicated to the vendors, and we're also going to be a vendor, and we'll talk about that at the end of the show, that are going to be exhibiting at the show. The first vendor up, uh, that we're going to have on the show is AJ from Don Brown Bus Sales. AJ, are you there? Yes, I am. Good evening. Great. Welcome to the limo show. So I heard you got a little bit of snow out there. Yeah, just a little bit, not much. Uh, you know, we're located in Buffalo, New York. We we got a, a little bit of a dusting, but it, it went away pretty quick. Uh, Doug had mentioned that I guess uh, the snow stuck a little bit out in the Auburn area. It did, yeah, same thing, just about a couple inches here in the Albany area, so nothing we can't handle. No doubt, no doubt. Tis the season. Uh, so tell us about Don Brown Bus Sales, and uh, where's your booth going to be located this year, or floor space? This year we are in booth number 250. Um, we've got a 45 by 54 booth, again, number 250. Um, in that booth we're going to have quite an array of product offerings, um, Don Brown Bus Sales, as a whole, we sell and represent the product lines from StarCraft, Global, Ameritrans, Federal Coach, Tiffany Coach, and Crystal. And we'll be representing all of those product lines for the most part in our booth this year. You're going to have some buses there, I'm assuming? Absolutely. We will have five buses on the show floor this year. So which one is uh, the most unique of the five that you're going to have there? I would say this year is an all-new product that nobody's seen at a limo show just yet is going to be our 44-foot Freightliner chassis Tiffany Coach limo bus that you'll be able mm -hmm. to see this year at the show. What uh, what type of amenities does it have? That particular unit is going to be a 44-passenger limo bus uh, with a laboratory and rear luggage. And it's a new product offering from Tiffany and uh, really nothing else like it on the market right now. As far as the show this year, some specials that we would be running – um, this year, any bus purchases made at the limo show from Don Brown Bus Sales or two weeks after the limo show, we're going to be offering some special financing. That's going to be 90 days with no payments on any lease okay. or finance for any new bus and zero down payments. Zero down payments. That's zilch. That's not uh, uh, taxes, but no cap reduction or, or down payment. Just zero. Zero out of pocket? Zero out of pocket and no payments for 90 days on any bus purchased at the show or two weeks after the show. Wow, that's a great promotion. Now, is this something that, that uh, you guys have offered before at previous shows? Not at all. It's new this year. Um, you know, we really wanted to put our best foot forward. Our success last year at the Limo Digest show was phenomenal, and we really want to build on that, do everything we can do this year to make it successful. Now, you mentioned uh, before that you have the uh, StarCraft line. Uh, the StarCraft line, is that pretty much a shuttle bus type product? Uh, the StarCraft bus in itself is uh, really more of an entry-level shuttle bus uh, or paratransit bus. Don Brown Bus Sales sells and represents everything from school buses to motor coach. Um, mm -hmm. The StarCraft line would be our most basic line, um, followed by the Global products line. And then, of course, the higher-end offerings from Ameritrans, Federal Coach, Tiffany, and Crystal. No doubt about it. Now, how can the listeners out there reach you if they want to get in touch with you before the show or uh, if they listen to this uh, program after? If you're at the show, the best way to reach me would be my cell phone. That number is 518-774-4587. Again, 518-774-4587. My email, of course, is always available. That is aj at buscrazy.net. And our website, of course, to view our inventory is www.buscrazy.net. Awesome. Thank you, AJ, for coming on the show. We greatly appreciate it, and I look forward to seeing you there. Thank you. See you there. Sounds good. We have our, our next guest, and he's a gentleman that's been on the show before. Arthur, are you there? Arthur from Create a Card. I am here, Dave. Good evening. Good evening. How are you doing? Doing well. Um, we're not fighting the snow, but we're fighting the raindrops tonight. <laughs> no doubt. So you heard uh, you heard AJ and I talking about it. it uh, this last month, though, has been pretty rainy here. Uh, but uh, today, unfortunately, when I saw that snow, it kind of kind of kind of brought me down a little bit. That's okay. When the weather's like this, it keeps us all in the office and makes us work a little bit harder. So that's okay. 
Yeah, but the best part about this time of year is hockey season, at least for me, and I know I know it is for you too. Yeah, I just pulled it up. Islanders are down right now to the Penguins, you know, one nothing. They're trying to come back. They still have the season strong. JT was looking great, and then they're slowing up a little bit. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this, my Sabres have been doing pretty good, but they, they had a couple of rough games against Tampa. Uh, they're playing tonight. Uh, when I went upstairs before the show to do the show tonight, uh, the Sabres were, were up uh, one nothing. but I guess at this point in time, it's 2 nothing, and uh, there's been a lot of battles in the game tonight, and it's made it quite exciting. So, Arthur, where are you going to be located in the show, and, and what special deals uh, do you have offer this year for this year's Limo Digest show? This year, this is, um, I guess, as long as the Digest show has been in existence, Creator Card has been a vendor, which is nice. So when you come in the exhibit hall and you make a left, you go down about three or four booths, you'll see us on the left-hand side. We're booth number seven and eight this year. We have a double booth. Um, as we keep growing in size and our customer base, we seem to need more space at the show. So we have a double booth this year in booth seven and eight. Booth seven and eight. And what specials do you have? Well, this year is actually, uh, you know, what we're doing is we're trying to be creative, and we're 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 a marketing company, we're a printing company, and we're trying to always bring new products to market. And this year is going to be no different. We we have our staple products of our business cards, our postcards, and brochures. Um, we always do our marketing kits and promotional items. But this year, really, what we're going to be pushing, or what we'd like to be introducing to the ground transportation company, is our digital PDF files, which have been very very successful for us and our customers over the last um, three, four months. It's kind of a new product. It's a digital file, which gives them full full capability of a usable PDF file that they can attach to their emails, and they can use them in their, um, in their marketing plans. They can use them in their emails. And it's very simple, very small file that transfers over the Internet and very effective for a marketing company or a salesperson within the company. So that's the first thing that we're going to be introducing. And hot off the press... Nobody knows, but we're going to be introducing our first iPhone app for the ground transportation company. It's going to be a, oh, wow. a, a it's going to be an iPhone app that's going to be available for um, for the operator for them to supply to their customers. Not so much an application that's going to help sell them, but this is going to be a full functional and user friendly application that they'll be able to download for their iPhone, iPad, and Android. So we're really excited about that. We're in the final stages of it, and we will have it ready for the Digest show, and we will have it on debut, and we will be introducing that with a show special of $500 savings at the show for anyone that signs up for this new application. Wow, that's amazing. Now, I don't know if you know this, Arthur, the new MKT Town Care, when it comes out next year, uh, there's a way to basically take your applications that you have on your phone and merge them with this new MyTouch system. So it's going to be curious to see how your new app uh, can work uh, with this new technology that's coming from Lincoln in the future. I mean, technology is moving faster than we can. You know, by the time we go to sleep, somebody invented something new the next day. Um, we are in a real tech-savvy way right now, and the, the whole idea is to take advantage of it. Um, the way that nobody will give up a printed business card um, you still need to direct mail, and you still need collateral material, but we're also in a world where you need to be digital. You need to be you know, tech savvy, and this application is going to be something that's going to be ideal for a small operator. It could be a five-car operator to a 10-car operator to somebody that has 100-plus vehicles. But the nice thing is the way this program is set up, it's going to allow them to be very functional, allow them to take reservations, allow them to be um, advised of when a customer is ready for pickup, and it also even locates all the airports. So if a person wants to make a reservation through the app, they can make a reservation, and the operator will receive that information right away. Wow. That is absolutely amazing. Now, if a, if a listener wants to get in touch with you before the show, during the show, or after, how can they reach you? The best way, of course, is um, our web address is limocards.com. That's L-I-M-O-C-A-R-D-S.com. Or they could always reach us at our phone at the office. We are Monday through Friday, Eastern Standard Time. We run 9 to 5, and that's 631-584-2273. That's 631-584-2273. We look forward to helping anybody that needs anything before the show. It is a little crunch time, but we can still do it. We've been working 
24-7 right now trying to get exhibitors their information, getting operators their information. The the items that you spoke about, the affiliate guide, we've been supplying uh, people with their literature. So if there's still something that you need, give us a call. We'd be glad to help you. Otherwise, we'll be at the show, booth 7 and 8. And I will see you there. Thanks, Arthur, for coming on tonight. Dave, thanks so much. Always a pleasure and a great show once again. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, we have our next guest. Welcome to the Limo Show, Brian O'Neill. Thank you, Dave. It's an absolute pleasure to be here, and I'd like to take a minute to acknowledge the great guests that you've had on. Um, I know Chris Weiss and the entire Limo Digest team have been doing just an incredible job, as they do every year, getting this show to be the complete success it has been. And uh, all your other callers who have called in and have shown their support, it's definitely a great show to be a part of. It's a great organization, and it's uh, it's really a phenomenal opportunity. I know uh, MTG has had a ton of success at the show in the past, and we are all very excited about what we have to bring to the show this year. Now, I know I introduced you, but you work for MTG. Can you tell us about MTG and uh, where you'll be located at this year's show? Absolutely, Dave. Well, MTG has been, uh, we've been in business for just over 20 years, and MTG has really positioned themselves to be the industry's kind of one-stop shop for just about everything they could need from a limousine, sedan, van, or bus perspective, providing all the all the accessories and automotive pieces that they need to really help keep their vehicles on the road, keep their lights bright, and keep their electronic systems going. So it's really a very outstanding company that has, over the years, continued to provide customers with all their needs at one stop. Are you going to have any special deals at this year's show? Uh, we are, Dave. We're very, very excited about the show this year. We're going to be bringing our very well-known microgreen oil filter, which we've brought up in the past and have had a tremendous amount of success with, both both on a national level and in the livery industry. We're going to be offering a special 15% show discount to all customers, new and old, who step forward and decide to make a purchase during the show from November 6th to the 9th. And one of the things we're really excited about, Dave, um, last time I was on your show, we had referenced these vehicle camera systems and the importance of them in our industry today. Well, MTG is proud to announce that we will be unveiling our brand new TransCam in-vehicle camera system line to the livery industry. Four amazing systems, all available at a discounted rate of 5% for anybody who decides to purchase one to 24 systems and an amazing 10% discount to any company that buys 25 systems or more. And we have leasing options available, Dave, so they can finance these things anywhere from 12 months up to 60 months and really make a camera system affordable for any budget and any size company. Oh, this is great. Arthur mentioned his new app, and now MTG is, is uh, going to be introducing their new camera system. This is all great news. Yeah, this is great. And we're, we're going to be in booths 10 to 13, so I'll just be down the road from you there, Arthur. Arthur, I'll be uh, stopping by to say hello, and uh, we're very excited to see what all the exhibitors, including Arthur, has to bring to the show this year. Um, they always bring great items. And, you know, it's really just such a phenomenal opportunity for operators from all over our industry to see what the latest is in the uh, market, what they have to offer, and all the ways that we can kind of really shine through and show our services to so many people in one great function. I agree. Now, if a listener out there wants to get in touch with you before, during, or after the show, how can they reach you? Well, NTG also just launched our brand-new state-of-the-art website. Customers can go to www.mtgparts.com. That's M as in Mary, T as in Tom, G as in George, parts.com. Or they can call us toll-free at 1-800-362-6224 and ask for myself or any of the customer service associates. The operators are standing by, and we're ready to take care of everybody's needs. That is great. Brian, thank you for coming on the show, and I look forward to seeing you also next week. It's always a pleasure, Dave. I look forward to seeing you, and thank you very much. Another outstanding show. Thank you very much. Well, this is our the time when Town Livery gets to – tell you where we're going to be located. We're going to be located at booth number 29. That's booth number 29. We do specialize in selling to the limousine livery industry of North America. We offer new and used vehicles. And at this year's show, my focus is going to be uh, supplying the 2011 Lincoln Town Cars. As everybody knows out there, the 2011 Lincoln Town Car is the final model year 
Um, and after these vehicles are gone, and right now we have a, a very good supply after these models are gone, unfortunately the town car will be will be gone, and then we'll be moving on to the next era of livery vehicles. If you need to get information regarding town livery, you can find us on the web at www.town, with an E at the end, livery.com. That's www.town, with an E at the end, livery.com. Or you can call me on my cell phone number, which is 800-730-3683. Everyone that took part in the show, guys, I greatly appreciate it. I look forward to seeing you at the next show. And uh, for the listeners out there that, that have listened tonight, stop by my booth, introduce yourself. I'd love to meet you. And uh, hopefully I can answer any questions that you may have regarding our products. Thank you again for listening to The Limo Show, presented by, presented by Town Livery on Blog Talk Radio. We appreciate the time you've taken to listen to our program. The Limo Show comes to you 24 hours a day, seven days a week on Blog Talk Radio. So we encourage you to tune in and listen. Have a wonderful week, and I look forward to speaking with you on the next edition of The Limo Show. Good night.